Hey YouTube, Planner and Pens. I want to start off by thanking all of my subscribers and everyone who's watching my videos. It means so much to me and thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And just a reminder, if you're interested in the content and I will keep bringing good content to you, feel free to hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell so you can get notified when I upload a new video. Once again, thank you so much. I really appreciate it and I love all of your comments. Okay, so guess what I tried? Well, I didn't try it yet. I'm going to try it with you. I finally bought the Varsity Everyday Fountain Pens. Now, these are disposable pens, and there's a lot of videos on YouTube about people filling them, but I don't know if I'm going to hack that and fill it just yet. But I just did want to try out. It's economical. Um, it was under $20 to get this. I think it was like $13 or something like that on Amazon. Um, I'll put that um, in the description there. But I just figured I should try it. I mean, why not? It's an everyday fountain pen and it comes in some cool colors. So let's get started. I'm going to use my Rhodia dot pad to try it out. That's my, uh, it's the book I use to try out all my colors and stuff. Huh, let's see. Looks like we got a little sticky here. Not much of one. Actually, I like these little tapes, like they come in handy, so I don't get rid of them. <laughs> Is that bad? Yeah, it's probably bad. Wow. Look at how cool the colors are. I, you know what? Should I go this way? Okay, I'll start with black because this is black and it's this way. That's turquoise. I like turquoise. It's a great color. Let's see how it looks. It's so lightweight. It just feels okay. It doesn't even feel like a ballpoint pen. It's really super light. And it feels very sturdy though. Light and sturdy. And obviously you can post it. Posting just meaning you can put the cap on. And it gives it a pretty decent length. Let me just show compared to like um, my Twisby. This is the Twisby Eco. So this is it posted. And the Twisby Eco, if I post it. Oh, wow. Look how much longer that is. Look. So it... It's not as long. And the Twisby Eco, I think it's, it's slightly a little long, but it's a good length. This is this is nice. It, there's no extra weight on it. That may be a good or bad for some people. They like extra weight, but it's, it's light as a feather. <laughs> okay, let's try black. And these are all mediums. So you don't have a choice. It's, it's a medium or nothing. Okay, let's see how it writes. Oh, it just starts writing right away. It's nice. Pilot. Varsity. Medium. Um, it's kind of cool. It's, I say, uh, slightly on the finer side. Not, not too thick. Not super. It's actually pretty nice. It's definitely, let's see. You hear the tiny bit of scratchy, but not not much. I wonder. Oh wow. Upside. Well, it's not really upside down. It's really more reverse. Re a little bit of skipping with the reverse.
Huh, that's pretty nice. Let's check out the colors. So that was black. And then this little case, it has these little notches here. So when you put it in, this little ballpoint thing just goes into the notch. So that comes in handy too. Let's see how the blue looks. I love blue. Um, some people don't like blue as a writing. And you know what's cool? This color on the end here. So it's on the, the cap end here. So you know what color it is. So you know you have to, like if your cap rolls off. Let's try blue. Huh. I would say this is like... Um, A royal blue. And don't you think? It's kind of like a royal blue. Very nice. Pretty. These can come in really handy, these colors. You know, without having to ink it like you normally do. Let's do the red. Ooh, look at that. Kind of has a little shiny. You can see the ink. Is that the ink? That's a good amount of ink. Is it? <gasps> it is the ink. Wait, let's see if you can tell. You too, hold on. You see it moving? Ooh, that's pretty cool. Let's try red. Wow. Okay, so the red is definitely not deep. It is definitely bright. Almost like a fire. Orange. Red. But not really, but like fire. But it's bright. It's not deep. So if you're looking for a deep red, I'm seeing the camera looks like it's a little deeper. It's not. It's definitely on the lighter side. See? But it's a good red. Like say if you're in the teaching profession. Okay. And then this. Huh. Well, I guess it's the green. Just should it be regular green? Let's see. Nice. This is like uh, not a. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I'm all lightsaber green. Yeah, that helps. Lightsaber green. Um, oh, it's like, or kind of like grass. Grassy. Kind of like grass, more like a lightsaber. But, you know, we can't talk about things that are not real all the time. All right, let's see, pink, which I never think about that color really. Ah, I'll say this is true pink. Just whatever you think true pink is. Almost like bubble gum. Yep, it's a good pink. It's, it's, it is spot on pink. And they're all writing the same way. They're all writing well. Okay, let's see if this is dark or light. Let's see. Ooh, pretty. Purple. Oh, it's rich. Mmm. Uh, it's definitely rich. It's not light. It's, it's I'm going to call it just right. <laughs> 
What else does it look like? Okay, so it's like a medium. A little bit of, that's a little bit of skipping or if that's me. I think that might be me. So it's purple, rich, just right, medium. And, oh, please let this look good. I feel this should be. Yep, like like the gem, gemstone. Yeah, let me just see if it's me or is it skipping? I gotta give it a little more pressure. So give a, see, I'm not doing that. It's me, bit of pressure. Or it skips. So I feel you have to give it a little pressure or, or, or it can skip. I mean, you know, it's, that's how I feel. Give it a bit of pressure or it skips. But those are the colors. Black. And it's definitely, I think, I think, I think it's on the finer side. It's not like heavy for a medium. It's, it's a nice medium. I think it's a good medium because it kind of fits in between what you might want on a document, um, on Hobonichi, uh, that type type of thing. Very nice. Very nice. I like it. And I just wanted to show you guys, I got some stickers. And this company is amazing. It's from the Coffee Monster Co. And this girl's really cool. She has her own YouTube channel. And I just wanted to show you the stickers. I'm not getting anything to say this. It just, I just thought they were really good quality. It comes from Canada. So if you're, if you live in the States, you know, it takes not long i it, it, it within two weeks you know but you know you're not getting them in th one to three days unless you pay extra but these are like a coffee date coffee capricorn fountain pens really nice quality i got the, a few of those and planner stickies and then she gave some really cool um freebies like that but they're good quality, and so I don't know if anyone, you know, we're always looking at stickers, I think. <laughs> so, um, really nice. Oh, she has it listed right there. Oh, right, it's my Hobonichi stickers, see? Really nice quality, smooth and beautiful. And this girl is really young, too, that um, does this, and pretty, pretty amazing. But the other pin, um, you guys can check out my videos that I am using now. I'm so excited. It's the Narwhal. Narwhal. N-A-R-W-H-A-L. I did a video on it, but I just wanted to show you how it looked in my Hopadichi. And that's it right there. So it... Um, fits really well really really well in there so um but check out the video on that i just wanted you guys to see how it looks on that but anyway this has been really cool this was um pilot varsity and uh i think they're worth it you know they're inexpensive and you can get a whole lot of colors and Amazon actually has them because they're hard to find in the pack. Sometimes you just see one or two colors, but Amazon, you know, Prime, you can get the next day or same day. Um, it's it's worth it. It's a good pen. It's a, definitely a good everyday fountain pen, and you're not worried about it because you didn't spend like a fortune on it, and so if you lose it, it's okay. Um, but it comes in a good uh, variety of colors, as you can see, more medium, I would say a finer medium, but uh, really good pens. And that's all I was here to say. All right. And once again, thank you all to all my subscribers. And I hope we, I will get some new ones. And as always, peace and love from Planner and Pens.